Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at running a Debian 12 Bookworm VM in VirtualBox. To get started, navigate to Debian.org and download the latest installation ISO. Once the download completes, launch VirtualBox Manager and create a new VM. Give the VM a unique name and set the target folder path. Then browse to and select the downloaded Debian 12 installation ISO. The type should automatically set to Linux Debian 64-bit. If it doesn't, make sure to set it. Check the Skip Unattended Installation box. Then under Hardware, set base memory to at least 4 GB and processors to 2 or more. Click the Hard Disk section and set the hard disk to 30 GB or more. Then click Finish. With the new VM selected, click Settings. Select the display option from the left navigation menu and slide the video memory all the way to the right. Then under the network settings, set the attached to to bridged adapter and click OK. Then click start to power on the VM. At the Debian 12 boot menu, press enter to select graphical install. Select a language, then click continue. Select a location, then click continue. Confirm or modify your keyboard, then click continue. Enter a host name, and on the next screen, an optional domain name, then click Continue. Leave the root password blank, then click Continue. Enter a full name for the user, then a username, then enter and confirm a password. Select a time zone, then click Continue. Leave the default guided use entire disk, then select SDA. Select all files in one partition, then finish partitioning and write changes to disk. Select the yes option for write the changes to disk, then click continue. Wait while the disk is partitioned and base Debian files are copied and installed. When prompted, select no to scan extra installation media. Select yes to use a network mirror. Select a mirror closest to your location, then one of the available hosts. If needed, enter your proxy address. Choose if you'd like to participate in usage statistics. When prompted, choose which optional software you'd like to install. Wait while the additional software packages are downloaded and installed. When prompted to install Grub, select Yes, then Continue. Select the Dev SDA device, then click Continue. Once the installation completes, click Continue to reboot the VM. At the login screen, log in with the password we created during setup. Open the Applications menu, then search for and open the Terminal application. Edit the apt sources list using the Nano Editor. Comment out the CD-ROM source if it's not already by putting a pound sign, then save your changes and close out of Nano. Next, we'll run sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade to install any available software updates. Then we'll run apt clean to reclaim any space being used by the apt package cache. Now we'll install a few prerequisite packages required to install the VirtualBox guest editions. Select devices, insert guest edition CD image from the VirtualBox menu. Then in the file manager, navigate to the CD drive. Right click in the white space and select open in terminal. Using sudo, execute the vboxlinuxeditions.run file. Once the installation completes, reboot the VM to apply the changes. After the reboot, log back in. 
You should now be able to resize the VirtualBox window, and the virtual desktop resolution will refresh to match it. Welcome to Debian 12 Bookworm, running as a VM in VirtualBox.